helping to make your life easier. Local every day. When you are bothered by allergies, you might receive steroid injections to help symptoms. Well, today I'm visiting with an allergist about the difference between steroid and allergy shots. Dr. Hannah Newhouse is here from Allergy, Asthma and Immunology Associates PC. Nice to have you here, doctor. Thank you for having me. So what is the difference between an allergy shot and a steroid shot? So um, an allergy shot is a shot which given, is given as part of a series of injections for allergy immunotherapy. Um, during allergy immunotherapy, the goal of um, that is to try to retrain the immune system away from thinking that those allergens are dangerous and producing an immune response or allergic response and more towards a state of tolerance. And so the way that we do that is by um, giving a small amount of that allergenic protein um, in each allergy shot um, for a, to a patient over a series of time. And so they can get allergy shots anywhere between every one to four weeks for three to five years, depending on the schedule. And so it's very good at producing long-term response um, to those allergens, um, it, so it's very effective. So a steroid shot helps to decrease inflammation for the short term, um, but it helps to, so it helps to decrease that inflammation right then, but it doesn't decrease the long term, the cause of that inflammation. Mm -hmm. and, um, and the steroids do have more side effects, and so with that, we try to limit steroids whenever possible for patients. Okay, what would be some of the side effects? So some of the side effects of steroids um, are most prominent in patients that have had um, recurrent steroids or longer term steroids, but some of the side effects we think about are mental health concerns, irritability, anxiety, depression. We also think about things like increased blood pressure, increased risk for infections, um, and they can also have decreased bone mineral density, which puts them at increased risk for fractures. Mm -hmm. And then there's also something called adrenal insufficiency, where um, your body stops producing its own steroids because it's used to getting steroids from the outside. And so, um, so in general, there because of those side effects, we try to limit that whenever possible. Okay, so if someone needs to have um, maybe aller allergy shots or a steroid shot, they would come to your office and you determine what's best for them in their situation, yep. right? Yep, that's perfect. And mm -hmm. again, steroids would be for the short term mm -hmm. if someone's really suffering and they need some relief. Uh-huh, right, yep. Okay, mm -hmm. perfect, all right. So if people need more information on this, they can just come and give your office a call. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. Right. Thank you, doctor. And for more information on Allergy, Asthma, and Immunology Associates PC, just go to 1011now.com.